video, we're gonna do a quick impression video. I know a lot of you know that I do a lot of hair color products review or hair color reviews here in my channel. I think I did four videos, so I will share everything in the description. So after watching this video, if you're interested, you can check it out. And for today's video, we're reviewing the brand Shades Cream Hair Dye. Sobrang haba nung sinabi ko. Anyway, so if you're interested, this one costs less than 80 pesos. So bumili ako ng tatlo nito, so it only costs less than 200. I'm not really sure it's a specific price, pero binili ko kasi siya dun sa Save More. It's available on Shopee, so I will link it down in the description. So anapi ko siya sa Shopee para matry nyo rin. I really wanna try this out kasi isa siya sa pinakamurang hair product. And I know I've not yet tried this product. So this is gonna be my first impression in this channel. So if you're interested, then please keep on watching. The first one that I got is the shades hair dye na cream colorant. So para sa yung actually hair shine na tinray ko. Second one is the hair developer. So ito na yung formula na nilalagay para magstick yung product dito sa hair. So sobrang tagal ko na gumagamit ng hair colors ever since fourth year. Sobrang sanay na ako magtulay ng hair ko. So if hindi ka masyadong sanay, you can ask a guardian or a friend na tulungan ka para magpantay-pantay siya sa hair mo. And here's the last product na nandun sa loob. And this is the gloves that you're gonna use. So if wala ka nung parang pang apply sa hair, you can use this. Or simply ask a friend or your family if andyan man sa bahay ka lang since quarantine. Huwag ko ba talaga ko sinasalo? Anyways, ito yun. Ito yun. <laughs> okay, now na alam na natin yung laman yung product. Tapos na yung video. Charot. Anyways, so now we're gonna do is imimix ko siya. Ito. I-mix ko siya dito. So, meron ako dito ang container na hindi na ginagamit. And then, ito. Para ata itong galing dun sa isang product. Pero, gagamitin ko siya since ako lang mag-apply. And then, i-fast forward ko na lang kung paano kong hahaluin kasi tatlo to. So, that you will know on how to do it yourself as well. And I'm done mixing the product. So, ito na siya. Three, ano to? Three boxes to. And medyo malaki yung container ko. So, sobrang dami niya. So, if may see lang hair nyo, I really suggest one to two lang. And then, naglagay na rin ako ng gloves. So, I will do this in a fast-forwarded wake. And dito na yung mirror. So, may kita nyo tingin ako ng tingin nandito. Ako lang mag-isa kasi very sanay naman na ako. So, if hindi ka sanay, maghanap ka ng kasama mo para mas pantay siya. May iba kasi na hindi nila napapansin na yung roots or yung sa bandang dito sa likod pag tinali is hindi pantay. So, yun. Enjoy this fast-forwarded video. So, I'm back. I'm done coloring my hair. Ayan. As you can see, kumalat na siya sa buong katawan ko. Like, meron sa legs, meron sa arms. Pero sa arms, binanlawan ko. Mabilis naman siya matanggal. Ayan. So, sabi sa box... What the fuck is that? is 30 minutes siya. Pero I will try and wash it after 45 minutes. So, see you after 45 minutes for the results.
Hello everyone! So today is Saturday and dito ako sa labas. So nag-color ako ng hair ko noong Thursday, 5pm. Kaya hindi ko na siya pinahita sa inyo kasi medyo gabi na nun. So hindi na maganda yung lighting. So nandito ako sa labas para ipakita sa inyo yung natural hair color ko when it comes to the natural sunlight. And to be honest, hindi siya ganun ka-brown or hindi rin siya ganun ka-black. So parang in the middle lang siya. So parang siya yung typical Filipina hair color. So if you really want a little bit more on the brown side, I really suggest the light brown. Kasi ang ginamit ko kasi yung medium brown. So alam ko meron sila light brown, may medium brown, and meron din silang dark brown. So ito na yung outcome niya. So magpo-photoshoot na lang ako para makita niyo yung before and after. Kasi napicturean ko yung hair color ko before. So, that's it for today's video. If you like it, please give it a big thumbs up. And comment down below more video suggestions you want me to do for you guys. And always remember to have a software interface. So, bye! See you in my next videos.